स्टूडेंट्स दिस इज एन सी आर टी एक्सरसाइज प्रॉब्लम टू पॉइंट थर्टी सेवन फ्रॉम पेज नंबर सेवेंटी वन ऑफ स्ट्रक्चर ऑफ एटम राइट सो लेट्स रीड दी स्टेटमेंट द डायमीटर ऑफ जिंक एटम इज टू पॉइंट सिक्स ऑन स्ट्रॉम कैलकुलेट फर्स्ट रेडियस ऑफ जिंक एटम इन पीकोमीटर एंड सेकेंड नंबर ऑफ एटम्स प्रेजेंट इन अ लेंथ ऑफ वन पॉइंट सिक्स सेंटीमीटर इफ दी जिंक एटम्स आर अरेंज साइड बाय साइड लेंथ वाइज राइट सो इन दिस क्वेश्चन यू हैव the diameter of zinc atom that is 2.6 angstrom if i'll make a zinc atom definitely its diameter is 2.6 angstrom and you have to find the radius of this zinc atom in picometer right and next question is you have to find the number of atoms present in a length of 1.6 that means these zinc atoms are arranged side by side and uh, its total length is 1.6 cm right so first of all we'll see the first problem in this problem we have to find the radius of zinc atom so firstly we'll write diameter of zinc atom it is 2.6 angstrom right now i'll convert this value in meter right so i know that 1 angstrom is equal to 10 raised to power minus 10 meter right so you can write over here 1 angstrom equal to 10 raised to power minus 10 meter now radius of zinc atom will be half of the diameter of zinc atom right so diameter by 2 so diameter is 2.6 into 10 raised to power minus 10 meter divided by 2 21 the 2 21.3 the 2.6 so 1.3 into 10 raised to power minus 10 meter over here but our main question is we have to find the radius of zinc atom in picometer now 1 picometer is equal to 10 raised to power minus 12 meter now i have to convert this value in picometer right so i'll assume 1 0 over here right so 1 2 i'll displace this decimal up to two digit from left to right so power will be negative and displacement is up to two digit so it will be 10 raised to power minus 2 Into ten raised to power minus ten over here. Unit will be meter, right? These two powers are in multiplication, so you can simply add them. So one thirty into ten raised to power minus two minus ten, right? So ten raised to power minus two minus ten, it will be ten raised to power minus twelve, right? And unit meter over here. I know that one picometer equal to ten raised to power minus twelve meters. So one thirty. picometer is the radius of zinc atom now our next target is to find the number of atoms present in 1.6 cm length let's see the second part i know that diameter of zinc atom is the length of zinc atom right so you can write over here diameter of zinc atom can be considered length of zinc atom so diameter of zinc atom is 2.6 into 10 raised to power minus 10 meter now our first target is to convert this 2.6 into 10 raised to power minus 10 meter in centimeter right so i know that 1 meter equal to 100 cm and this 100 cm can be written as 10 raised to power 2 let's put the value over here so 2.6 into 10 raised to power minus 10 into 10 raised to power 2 units cm only right so these two powers are in multiplication so you can simply add them 2.6 into 10 raised to power minus 10 plus 2 right 10 raised to power minus 10 plus 2 it will be 10 raised to power minus 8 so diameter of zinc atom is 
2.6 into 10 raised to power minus 8 centimeter, right? Let's apply the unitary method and find the number of atoms in 1.6 centimeter length, right? So you can write 2.6 into 10 raised to power minus 8 centimeter is the length of zinc atom. equal to 1 atom that means 2.6 into 10 raised to power minus 8 centimeter is the length of 1 atom. Now 1.6 centimeter is the length of zinc atoms equal to so this value 1 atom will be in numerator divided by a the first value on the left side that is 2.6 into 10 raised to power minus 8 centimeter into the second value on the left side that is 1.6 centimeter right I will cancel centimeter with centimeter so it will be 1.6 into this 10 raised to power minus 8 when I will take this in numerator it will change its sign so it will be 10 raised to power 8 divided by 2.6 this 1.6 is less than 2.6 I just want to make this value higher so that I can do division easily right so what I'll do I'll simply remove the decimal so 16 by 10 into 10 raised to power 8 divided by 2.6 6 right this 10 means it is 10 raised to power 1 when I'll take this 10 raised to power 1 in numerator it will change its sign right so you can write 16 into this 10 raised to power 1 can be written as 10 raised to power minus 1 into 10 raised to power 8 divided by 2.6 units atom when you will divide 16 with 2.6, your answer will be 6.154. These two powers are in multiplication. So you can simply add them. 10 raised to power minus 1 plus 8 and units atoms only. So 10 raised to power minus 1 plus 8, it will be 10 raised to power 7. So 1.6 centimeter is the length of 6.154 into 10 raised to power 7 atoms.